Hey, what up, YouTube? It's Big Drink here. Welcome to Drink where We're back with another one reacting to Back on Pig. T-Rail gets Heather to cry again. It seems like the reunion of some of the first episodes, everything comes full circle. You know what I'm saying? Everything goes 360, 720, 1080. He's doing laps around that. So, something goes on on this episode. Heather starts crying. Let's get right into it. Okay, you know Here it Can is. I get some tips on accepting myself as a fat man? How? Wait, he said, yeah, can, get can I get tips? some tips on accepting myself as a fat man? You don't need no tips on accepting yourself. Nigga, love yourself. Nigga, if nobody else love you, nigga, love yourself. If they don't, fuck them. Nigga, live your life. What the fuck? Okay. Yeah, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? Go get some chili cheese fries yeah. and just go ahead. You <laughs> live your life, and bro. We do <laughs> Anytime there is going to be a topic on self-worth, <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Self-worth uh, or, you know, how, how do you value yourself or physical appearance, anything like that. Heather is going to step in. You know what I'm saying? I've noticed, man, it'd be the most beautiful women <coughs> that the most beautiful and naturally beautiful women that want to sit here and have these negative thoughts on their own, you know, self-image. And they want to get these surgeries or whatever and boost, et cetera, et cetera. And it's like, bro, who has failed y'all in the process? Shit, it has to be some mental health shit, bro. Hey, but Heather always gonna speak up on this type of shit, anything like that. And as soon as I saw this topic come up, bro, I could read her body language. You could read it. She's not fucking with what they what they got going on. Like they, they're about to speak on it, and she can already tell that they are not about to give the message that she wants to portray on back on fig when it comes to this. You can't yeah, make somebody I mean. that's like me making somebody. Yeah. I want you to love me. Go I want you to bitch. Get a man. stain. Okay, you can't shame the fuck on you. Live your life, brother. Being a being a overweight person, I understand that it's hard to love yourself when you're you're not the person that you. <laughs> <coughs> voice crack <coughs> voice crack she already was about to start crying I understand that it's hard to love yourself when you're you're not the person that you always known that you are so what because you worried about what everybody else think about you i don't worry about what everybody else i can't read i can't write or whatever i don't give a fuck I that's right smack that's how you do that shit they're gonna fuck with you if they really fuck with you you know what i'm saying if they don't fuck with you regardless if who you know what i'm saying you're gonna love me for me you gonna love me for me. You gonna love me for exactly who the fuck I am. You gonna fuck with me for me. If you don't, sorry. Shame the fuck on you, as Smack would say. <laughs> Shame on you. I am me. Whether yeah. you gonna like me or not. Wait. I get that, but you've always not been able to read and write. Whatever your 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 narrative. But if we've always been fat, or we've always been ugly, or we've always been this, you know, whatever. Like, or we haven't been like me. I she ain't have to come for smack head like that though she ain't have to come for smack head like that that was crazy right y'all seen how that was crazy you seen how she came for smack head y'all seen it <laughs> i haven't always been overweight i've been popping in my time like i was skinny whatever had all the niggas then i <laughs> yo t rail's face off rip <laughs> <laughs> Yo, bro, bro is not fucking with it. Anytime Heather starts talking about what she used to do and the whole <laughs> the whole having niggas and she was that bitch, that shit is whack. If you were a nigga now, stop talking about what you used to be on. Like, you know what I'm saying? Especially if he's not that type of nigga talking about his past when he had a fire past like T-Rail because this nigga does not sit here and bring up how many bitches he, you know what I'm saying? Other niggas do it. And he sits right there and usually plays dumb. He be respectful. Don't yeah, you know what I'm saying? You be going up on here. Always been overweight. I've been popping in my Love time. Like I was Fine skinny, as whatever had all the niggas. Then I got fat, I had a babies, all the shit. You start feeling <laughs> I had I had a <laughs> I had a babies. I had a babies. Feeling down on yourself and you start feeling like that like you're not nothing. I've been there. It's very hard. Bro, what I've the never fuck? Been there. Yeah, I've never been there. Let's, cut this, let's cut this out. Nigga, what the feel fuck that does, too. What the fuck? What the fuck does you being skinny and having all the niggas got to do with anything? It's over. Oh, but you've been with me for so long. Why do you keep talking about you having all the niggas and all the shit? We don't care. I don't we care. don't give a fuck. I don't care. Wait, hold on. 
<laughs> it's a real micro like you got a real quick little insight into their relationship she doesn't care she feels like t-rail often doesn't give a fuck about some shit she has to say but you know what i don't care that you don't care he's not saying that for no reason bro he's saying that because thousands of fucking comments be in chat every episode y'all drop talk about you be on some you're in a, like some other type shit i don't want they be trying to call you a 304 and, and he really standing for you he trying and he's trying to stop that behavior that's making them you know what i'm saying say that type of shit so same way he he kind of had that episode on smack on camera sometimes people need to be on camera like because he's clearly saying shit to y'all behind the scenes but it's not catching so he has to address it on camera he's about to get the urine i mean hold on don't worry about nothing five thousand shame on you this is narrative he don't care we care. don't give a fuck. I don't care. Well, look, hold on. I don't, I don't look, hold on, hold on. But we don't care about you. Thought no, you was popping. You're popping now. Or you want to pop? We don't care. About Wait, look you. at Thought look at her hand towards Smack. Like she think he about to jump in. But you was popping. You're popping now. Or you want to pop? We don't care. No. They accept you. They love you for who you are already. We don't give a fuck. Ah! Smack put his head down. Ah! <laughs> It's over. He, 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 that when you hope he puts his head down, he already know all oh, this ball, oh, man. This is gonna be an awkward, awkward ass car ride home. I don't want to deal with this shit, gang. Oh man, we were supposed to go out to eat. Oh fuck, damn, nigga, we were supposed to go out to eat after this shit. Damn, nigga, me and her gotta do the episode tomorrow. Damn, nigga, you doing this? She about to cry. She about to end this whole shit, nigga. She gonna sink the shit. Stop bringing that whack ass shit up, dog. What? Like, that that shit I was fat. No, nah, just just stop bringing whack ass shit up about we all the niggas are the niggas like shut the fuck up like the people love you already dog you no, don't have to I you don't have that. to we don't have to you don't have to bring up your past or the, you know what i'm saying the, what you what you do what you did in the past or you know to have people respect you as who you are people you work <laughs> hold up hold up because i was watching this live and i didn't see the nigga in the chat hold up look look at the top left dream chaser she gonna cry <laughs> wait i gotta move my shit y'all can't even see it because that nigga called it out he called it out right at the top left yo she gonna cry nigga says she gonna cry <laughs> i'm gonna throw myself in the middle so y'all can see the chat hold up have people respect you as who you are people haven't even really got to really know you yet like no they one really knows. are though so you don't have to keep saying that shit to people you know what I'm saying? just give your perspective i'm really just trying to teach you right now give your perspective he really just trying to teach her right now but the people you know what I'm saying? just give your perspective i'm really just trying to teach you right now give your perspective on what's going on right now in the moment and you good you don't have to keep bringing up what's going on or, no you know but i'm just comments going crazy i'm telling you they be saying she for the street she a 304 and yeah you know, it seemed like she have a young mindset like but you know what i'm saying she bossed up kind of younger so i feel like you miss you miss a lot of shit when you kind of have to boss up and be on your running you know what i'm saying you running shit you doing certain shit like you don't get to you didn't get to enjoy or live or i don't know it's interesting because the way she speaks is though she did enjoy and did live but she has the mindset of like the young mom who didn't get to live her like teenage years so she's 30 now trying to live those to make people like, you know, respectfully that's my narrative how i felt yeah, that, like, yeah. how you felt but you ain't gotta like say that. well i had this and i was popping when i was popping like no you wasn't popping like you wasn't like you never was popping yeah, no, <laughs> you, was, like, you was never popping i don't care no you wasn't I, and i'm not yes, gonna I never, was. but you want to explain it so go ahead and explain it because if you want to explain it just get it all out now because we don't give a fuck and no I don't you either. don't care i don't i don't so you explain <laughs> it so because you you always I'm even lost up. what i'm even talking about i right know now. so <laughs> i don't give a fuck about you, you being popping or you used to be popping Oh, but I don't give a fuck about your TikTok. I don't give a fuck about none of that shit. Just let's You're stay regular. Let's just, just stay regular. Whoever sends the super chat, I'm yeah, just saying man. love yourself. Yeah, love it's yourself. okay to not feel normal. It's okay to not feel your normal self, but you yeah. will get there. And people will love you for that. If that's where you're meant to and stay, and that's you. where you're meant and to be, you'll be that and you you'll will. stay that. I'm saying yeah, that. They, they, so, they, we right. And we right. We don't care about what Oh, I ain't even peeped that. I don't want to. I'm saying yeah, that. They, they, so, they, they, we right. And we right. We don't care about Be that. You'll stay that. 
I'm saying yeah, that. They, they, so they, we right. And we right. We don't care about what you was doing when you yeah. say that. I'm saying yeah, that. They, they, so they, they, we right. And we right. We don't care about. You'll be that. And you you'll will. say that. I'm saying yeah, that. They, they, so they, they, we right. And we right. We don't care about. You'll be that. And you you'll will. say that. I'm saying yeah, that. They, they, so they, they, we right. And we right. We don't care about what you was doing when you was younger. You thought you was popping with all the niggas. <laughs> all the I'm people are all the cars or all the money or all of that. Like, don't, don't, you know what I'm saying? We I'm don't got to do that. I'm not saying that. I'm saying I felt zero percent. Yeah. Should I go I home? That. Should yeah, I leave? Cool to feel all right. that. All right, it's smack, cool. smack is so <laughs> uncomfortable. <laughs> Like so Smack is so like uncomfortable like right now, my nigga. I don't nigga. want anybody to ever feel like how I felt. That's what I'm saying. And that's good. You feel I don't want to cry in a show. I don't want to do all this bullshit on you don't your have show. To. It's you real. That's why I say you gotta, People you, go through it. Yeah, Girls but, go through it. And guys go through it. Yeah, we, we do. You do. You feel me? And you so shut up. I'm not saying anything. I'm just saying. No, but you, you, I'm you not know, saying you anything. I'm just saying. She sounds... Yo, she sounds like Krishan Rock right now. Nah, I just equated too many things at one time. You feel me? It's just like you want to make people feel like you you're something, and you're like we know. You know what because I'm saying? We know. everybody that God well, we put know, on this though, earth, though, we know though. We don't have to explain. But everybody God put on this earth should feel like there's something. You know, but you are something. We feel that. We know that. But you don't have to express it all the time. You know what I mean? That's how I'm annoyed over here like just by seeing her cry. Like, like I can already tell the whole wrong. room like, was just you. We fuck with you. We don't uh, uh, after that. You know what I'm saying? Like, uh, bro. What you've done and what you doing? Like, we we fuck with you already. You I'm know what I mean? That. You know what I'm saying? But next next topic. You know what I'm saying? I get it. You feel me? Don't worry about nothing. Bank goes. How you? Do Yo, it's funny as fuck. She punched his dead arm though. Doing was strong, <laughs> but don't know about uh charkers. I don't know what the hell that is. Yasmin and there Lopez, it is Yasmin and now she's seven, crying for the whole rest of the DMs episode back. i come in peace oh please exactly time then she Kitty starts reading Creed, the comments nothing wrong you know what I'm comments yeah, coming in w, w look at her east side kennels I'm saying smack on the BS. slight tantrum worked out a deal with frenchies if you deal with you. Uh, there's a comment that comes in on the left side being a him you know my boy saying about chocolate thicker than a snicker ad <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Look, T Rail right. She stay popping her shit and it be getting annoying, gang. Stop crying on stream. They oh, flaming her no cap uh, in the Luke chat. Yo, they be on Heather Head. Uh, they be on Heather Head. Now listen, they be on her head. She's sitting there, the chat pops up, she's reading it. And listen, eventually I think it gets to be too much. I was there live. Somebody said something very specific. And yeah, she no, she's I think she read that. I think she read that. Stop crying on stream. T-Rail just real. T-Rail, she stay popping her shit and she getting annoying. And then look, she reads it. Literally, this is right when she reads it. I, I remember seeing it. She just read it. She read one of them. She out of there. She just read the stop crying on stream. She gone. She gone. That thing. Fat. She gone. He brought it, you know she saying? gone. She, she out of there. Hey man, that's it. T Rail made Heather cry. I don't know. What do you guys think about that shit, man? I don't know. It's an interesting little dynamic. It's a it's a homie. It's two homies. One of their girlfriends is up there, bro. So interesting dynamic. Something always is gonna pop off when you got something like that. Especially with like a such an interesting triangle that they've got all are such characters and heather is so strong in her character t-rell is so strong in his characters there's that age difference smack is smack it's it's always going to be something with back on fig but let me know down below man do you think t-rell was right in telling his girl uh telling his girl essentially the truth there that niggas just don't care and that she need to stop doing that shit what do you think he should have held that shit for behind cameras because honestly he's probably already been telling her that shit behind camera same way he was telling smack but sometimes people got to see that shit on camera you got to do it in front of people you know what I'm saying? Got to make it happen live. Let the people see that this is... I, I am telling them. I am... You know what I'm saying? This for, that was for the people. Let let everybody know, yo, I'm putting that work in, trying to work the, with the team and, and whatnot, what have you. But, hey, y'all drop a comment. Let me know what you think down below. It ain't about what I think. It's about what you think. Like, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification button. It's somewhere on the screen. I'm out. I'll see y'all in the next one, man. Love y'all.